Good afternoon, everyone. Welcome to my kitchen. Uh, today is Memorial Day, and um, I was invited to a picnic, so I'm excited. We're gonna go boating, we're gonna do all this fun stuff. So I was assigned to make bread because everybody loves the way I make my bread. So I thought, what goes good with barbecue and hot dogs and all that stuff? So I'm making cornbread and I'm taking it, the box Jiffy cornbread mix, but I'm gonna kick it up to a next level. So stay with me. The ingredients are gonna be in the description box. And I'm doing a double recipe because there's gonna be a lot of people there. So the, the ingredient list on the YouTube is gonna be for one single uh, recipe. So first, this is the Jiffy cornbread mix. So I need six cups of my cornmeal and I and these I get um, a big box and I just I, I just add it to my little jar right here and I use the one and a half cup of this it's one box so I'm, I'm making a double recipe I need two boxes for each recipe so I'm doing six cups of the jiffy cornmeal or two boxes that's what you're gonna for one recipe, you're gonna need one, two boxes of the Jiffy corn bread mix. So this is all goes in one. So there is the milk, there is the eggs. We do milk, eggs. So get the ingredients from the description box. I almost lost an egg, that's okay. And I'm doing uh, sour cream on this. That's what's gonna make this cornbread really nice and moist. And I'm doing a double recipe because there's gonna be a lot of people there and they're gonna love this uh, cornbread. This is my oil. And I'm adding a little bit more sugar in it because I like mine a little sweet. So I added maybe about two tablespoons for each recipe so it's about four tablespoons because this is a double recipe so this is how we're going to do it we're going to mix all of this together and the eggs and the sour cream we need it to get incorporated in here and this is what it's looked like you don't need to mix it too much As long as you get everything incorporated in here. There we go. So my oven is preheated at 400. It's gonna take about 35 to 40 minutes to bake. So I have my um, pan. For one recipe, you will need nine by nine a square pan. So I have, this is uh, 11 by 15. So I have parchment on the bottom and this beautiful cornbread mixture is gonna go right in here. Level it up a little bit. There we go. And you put the parchment on the bottom because it'd be easier to pull it out and slice it when it's done. So there you go. So preheat it up at 435 to 40 minutes. And I'll come back and show you what it looks like when it's done. So there I am, my cornbread is already baked. Looks beautiful. So let it cool off a little bit. I baked it up 400 for 35 minutes. Don't forget, this is a double recipe. So that's why it probably took me a little longer, but 35, 40 minutes, it's probably all right. So there is, there is how we're gonna get it out. That's why we need it. We need the parchment on the bottom, so look at this. How is it? Just cut it out. 
that. I put it right on my cutting board right here. And I'm just going to cut it into even squares. And this cuts so beautifully. And I'm going to serve this with a butter, of course. Fresh butter. And I have some... This is a little different. This is orange blossom honey. So that's going to go in there. Now look at this. Look at this beautiful cornbread. Yum, yum. I want to taste this. So let me see how it is. Mm, mm, mm. Mmm, so good. It's gonna be even better with butter and honey. Thank you for watching. I hope you take the time and make this recipe. This is the best cornbread recipe and the easiest. So make sure you subscribe, share, and give us some thumbs up. Thank you for watching. Happy Memorial Day. Thank you, bye-bye.